So, in order to lift up the human rights of women in general, all these thousands of men went running off to Rome, right, where the blondie women are, we all know that, and then just for one Muslima, they left all their nan and their great nan and their second cousin and their aunties. Everybody's left on their own because all the men have to go. So the little boys and the women are left. How is this lifting up their human rights? <laughs> He's coming to start with me. Uh, hello, Uncle Salam Hussein. How are you, sir? Naughty, the How naughty are you, girl. sir? You have to first say greetings because in England it's a, it's a cultural thing. It's a cultural thing to say. How are you, sir? Are you okay? I'm fine. I'm yeah. really well. You're not wearing your camouflage. I don't believe it. Sorry? Where's the camouflage gear? You've left the army. So I haven't, long. I have It's because like, of the you're injury. Like a you're, not, you're not like a Cuban. Uh, it's got Cuban a wife Cuban. beater underneath. I haven't left the army. <laughs> I'm army man. Okay. I'm going to do whatever I can for my religion. Oh. Yes, yes. And subjugate. I'm going to send. Smite. I'm going to send. Shall I tell you about the special days? Sure. For 330 years ago, our prophet, peace be upon him, if you like. he said the ultimate human rights convention. Ah, okay. <laughs> he was the first feminist and he was a... Uh... ultimate human rights declaration. Is it? What? Yes. Subjugate them, smite Subjugate them, kill them where you find they, them. They call, they, okay. they, call, they call it the last ceremony. Ah, the last ceremony. Yeah. Okay. When he said, what did he, what say? Did he say about women's rights? rights? All people, yeah. listen to me and ah. try to comprehend. Yes. All of you are from Adam. Ah. Peace be upon him. Right. And Adam from dust. There is no superiority. Or a clay. Or a clay. Or a cloth. Or a spa. Or whatever it is. There is no superiority for a black, for Arab. Over non Arab. What about women? What about women? What about women? The women. Human rights. The, the women, the women yeah. in Islam yeah. are precious. Are because they've only got half a brain and they're ah, disabled. Ah, women, ah, she has half a brain. To you Islam. see. No, I'm not a Muslim woman. You see, I, oh, yeah, 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 you see either, either you listen. Yeah. Either you listen. You're not doing a monologue though, fam. I'm not. Exactly. So it's I, I, interactive. Okay, okay. I can understand. I'm Mansoor. One of the caliph, Muslim caliph, he waged a war. Sure, that doesn't sound like human rights. Yes, he waged a war against the Roman. That's not like Muslims. And he killed 90,000 because one single so the woman. the human rights went up because they yes. were dead. Ah, yeah. okay. One single woman get captured because by the... Because she was the property or what? One single woman yes. get captured by the Roman. Right. And he told him, he told the, the, the Roman king, release our Muslim woman. Was she someone's property though? Was she like a is a Muslim? Or a wife is or a Muslim or... woman. Okay, so what? But that doesn't mean that all the other women who are subjugated are getting lifted up by this woman being captured. All the men are going and dying to save this one woman, but your mum and your nan and your sisters are at home with no food. No food. What we do? Can you do me a favor, please? No. Huh? No. Answer. I answer this. Answer. I answer. Answer. <laughs> turn, turn, turn the camera to this man. Turn the camera to this no, man. No, what's going to do with the Muslim? And, and, and right, this is, this is the holy, this is the holy, the devil spirit when it comes to you. You might recognize it from looking in the mirror. The woman. All them women who were left by their husbands who went off to fight for the one woman. All those women who were being like a, you know, whatever, starving and losing their husband and their dad is getting killed in the war and they're deficient in religion and mind. What about those poor women who can't even think for themselves? How many you think died? Died, Muslim died. How long does the war take? 25 minutes? Or did they have to go a long way away, rescue the woman from the are Roman? You, are, you mocking, are you mocking me or as I'm asking? Uh, no, I'm asking you, but it seems a bit, of a bit of a silly scenario to me. You see? It, it doesn't bring up human rights. If you, if, you, if, you don't, if you don't read history, I you do are a big ignorant. I do read history. Did, did you hear about this battle, Amuria in Turkey? Fatha Amuria? When you say history, do you mean Islamic history only? It's history. Sure thing, call but it, I'm too busy reading about the Bible. Call it Roman, call it... I'm asking your opinion as a Muslim. So, in order to lift up the human rights of women in general, all these thousands of men 
women running off to Rome, right, where the blondie women are, we all know that. And then just for one Muslima, they left all their nan and their great nan and their second cousin and their aunties. Everybody's left on their own because all the men have to go. So the little boys and the women are left. How is this lifting up their human rights to have them like hungry? You see how evil you are? I'm evil now. Yeah. I am I am telling you. You see that lying is a sin in uh, Christianity. Yeah. yeah. Oh, you lying, see it, but you don't lie. Lying, lying is a big sin in Islam more really? than Christianity. Really? So don't lie then? I don't lie. You just told me I'm evil. For what statement? Because I'm asking you, you about the women. I am telling yeah. you. Yeah. I am telling you. The Muslims, the Muslims travel from Arabia. All that way. To Turkey. Sure. To save a woman. single woman. And what about the 99 other percent of all the other women they left behind? Yeah, yeah. This is not, were they allowed to work in those days? Did they uh, get some uh, assistance? Who was helping them women? You see, you see now the ignorance of Islam? I'm asking you the question to make a point, okay. not because I don't know. Islam, who's the first system who introduced social security? Exactly. Was it at that time? Of course. What do you mean, of course? Of course. But they've got mental, they've only 50% deficient brain. How can they know this stuff? Yeah. How can they learn to go and get the money or the... The food, or the clothing, or the whatever. The Muslim leader is yeah, not Why like you point to yourself when you say Muslim leader? Our leaders, sure. they are not like Boris Johnson. Okay. Yes, you go on school. They're more like Mohammed bin Salman, who's turned off the minarets and let women work in Saudi Arabia, chucked out all they of the hadith. They do work in Syria. They, they do now, they, they can live on their own. They, they can live alone, thereby they have to work you to see, pay the rent. See, I am talking to you about... About Islamic leaders, and I'm talking Islamic to you about leader. Mohammed bin Salman, who's yeah. running uh, child Saudi. Benefit. Child benefit. Child benefit. Child benefit, introducing Islam. Sure, that, I don't mind about that. How is... Be like the how is all your men going off to war and maybe dying? What benefit can give you your husband back? How, how you silly? How you silly think? At all home, stop calling me did silly did and did answer did the did point, did not did the did person. Did it. Which war in whole history, all the men left and left all the women like that? Oh, during the Russian Revolution, that would have happened for sure. Any any war all where the there's women, a very small all the men. Liar. I'm old not lying. Men. Old, old men. men don't go and baby boys and oh. little boys so don't go. So there is go. some men back, back here. Yeah? What, 90 odd years old? Sorry? What, the old men? What are they going to do? Only 90 years old? I don't know. I'm making that bit up. I'm saying oh, so too old to carry a sword me. and like <laughs> hobble to war. <laughs> They're walking to war but it's taken them so long it's finished. Everyone's home. So you With one me. arm. One arm. I know, I know. Never, you can't, you can't Answer say, my point. You cannot be reasonable. How is, no, I am being reasonable because I'm still talking to you. How is Muhammad, your prophet, not Muhammad, your opponent, Muhammad not. wrote the last sermon or said the last sermon. Said, yeah. He said, I'm bringing up the human rights. No, it doesn't matter if you're black or white or something. And I'm asking, did he even mention women in his last sermon? Did he mention, did he when mention he say, women when It's he going to come on the screen. When you say, What's yeah. that mean? All of you. Who was he talking to? He wasn't feminist like you. I'm not a feminist, I'm a Christian. When I say kul, kul lukum, all of you are from Adam. All of you understand men and Arabic. He doesn't say men and women and homosexual and boys and girls. But uh, actually, no. So if he was talking to all men, if he was talking to the Ummah. Who told you the Hajj was only men? Nobody. I'm not talking about the Hajj, you silly. I'm talking about the last sermon. The last sermon was women attending and men. How would I know that? Because the pilgrimage. Oh, so that means you're saying that after Muhammad passed away, women were then subjugated, like uh, pushed down a bit and only allowed out in public with a man and all that stuff and not allowed to go to school. I know you're jealous of Muslims. Oh, Is what? That true? Oh, God. Yeah, who wants salvation anyway? You jealous of Muslims. No, they wear, I'm not. They wear a hijab. I know. And they are not feeling like you. Not feeling like me. No, they're not feeling saved. They're not going to heaven. Today, today is 30. Temperature 30 degrees. I know because you haven't got your car key on. Yeah. You've taken yeah. off seven layers and a little Taliban flag thing. A yeah. scarf. <laughs> you still got it. Aye, Don't worry. Aye, aye, I'm not aye, casting aye. aspersions on your extremism. Why you, why you, why you trigger me? Why? Look behind why? you. It's panto, man. Why, why, why you trigger <laughs> why? me? You like to be triggered by me. You cannot trigger me. But you just said, why do I, you trigger me? I feel sorry for you. Do you? Yeah. Well, Brilliant. Why? Jesus doesn't. We are so Jesus doesn't. We are so compassionate. When see, is it? When we see someone like you, oh my God. Really? We feel very, very sorry. Yeah. Exactly. Yeah, you got a Taliban headscarf? Yeah, yeah. Uh, we are very, oh, oh. very sorry for you. Is that right? I, I, do you know what? I see your pity and I raise you if like you compassion. Now, I tell you, if you see now a Pakistani woman, look at this woman. 
Where? Yes, yeah, Somali. what about it? Oh, that's Somali. You, you were going on about the other week. No, you I don't. Where? You interview. No, I don't. You interview. I don't. She, she you're so so you're saying I'm too thick. Here. You're, I, I, Tomorrow we're going to wear a bikini. Is it? Of course. Why did you go to New York where your imaginary vagina was to say bikini? Why? They are so hot. Can you fit me uh, underneath your stomach? Uh, if I'm at home, I can wear whatever I like. No, outside, outside. No, I'm not going to. That's your fantasy, love. Did Jesus. Peace be Omar, upon seriously, let's get off my bikini clad body. Did who? Did Jesus. Peace be upon him. Yeah. Gee, I'll tell you what the New Testament says. Don't judge of the this brother here. Don't judge that brother because of what he eats. And why you, and in fact the Old Testament as well, I think, the Psalms, Proverbs, it says, why are you judging on the outward why things? The nuns, Excuse me, let they me they finish. <laughs> why are you judging on the outward things? What you eat, what you wear, what you uh, outwardly do when God sees into your heart. Because if you eat Not because pigs, it's a rhetorical if question. You eat pigs, you're be Jesus said, I Jesus said, are you so stupid that you don't understand? And he was thinking of you, bro. He said. Whatever goes into the mouth and out again can't make you unclean. No, what comes no, from no, your no, heart, no. i.e. thinking about me in a bikini pigs, and whatever, uh, okay. and comes out your mouth, uh, you then pigs. that makes you unclean. Uh, if you eat pigs, you're yeah. going to be a pig. Is that right? You're going to be but Allah jealous. changed the Jews into a pig without them eating pig. They, they disobey him. Oh, well, it's time for some voodoo then. Yeah. <laughs> sure. They disobey him. Don't forget the monkeys. You, you don't want to stop being prejudiced against the animals. Yes, you're gonna. And you're I gonna disobey be, him all the time. And you're gonna be. You're, you've been cursed. Why? Because I've been cursed with salvation yeah. and a circumcised heart. Circumcised heart? Yes. Huh? Sorry. Isa, you know that geezer you make out your love. He's the one who said it. Circumcised heart? Yes. Oh my yeah, god. Because you got a heart of stone. <laughs> oh my god. You got a heart of stone like the stone that you kiss in uh, Saudi Arabia. Circumcised no, sorry, it's not stone. Circumcised uh, heart? Yeah. Stone, and fine. ears as well. Your eyes are scaled and your ears hey, are a bit moody I and wish. all. I pray to the Almighty. Yeah. What? Yahweh? Go on, Omar. Pray to Yahweh. Yeah. Hey. If temperature hey, hey, go hey. higher, we're going to see you in a swimming costume. <laughs> I'm sorry. That's your personal prayers, love. You keep them private, mate. Because it ain't happening for you, son. You see? Not unless you follow me to Mallorca or somewhere. <laughs> Why are we in? Why are we in? Why are we in? Underneath, underneath the niqab, I've got Muslim friends. They're wearing shorts and a vest. Underneath because it's so hot. Because they are like you. Oh, shush. We had you can wear what you like underneath the niqab. Yes. You can wear knickers and a bra. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, well, then there you go. See? Shorts and a vest and a big bed hadith. sheet. Our prophet, peace be upon him, said, Al-mar'u ala deeni khalilihi. That's nice, man, man. What does it mean? A man or a woman is as his companion. Well, my Jesus says that, um, you know, by their fruits you will know them. Not you'll know their mates as well. So if you, if you because your friends can pretend to be pious and you can be going along. Forget for it. We're not in pretending. What's we're, pretending? We're talking about... You're going to be known by the fruits of your friends. So if your friends are all extremists, that means what you're going to be judged. Extremist? I'm asking, if your friends are all vegetarians, you're going to be judged as a vegetarian. If all your friends like My Little Pony, you you're going to be judged as a vegetarian, by, yeah. you're going to be judged as a donkey. He makes it up as he goes why, along, why, same as Mohammed. Why, why you friend as you, why I you don't know. Friend? You should choose your friends better. I, I, <laughs> why I think what do your friends do? Are they exactly like you? Isn't it boring to have like 10 Omars all together <laughs> pointing at women and judging so them on their clothing? Your friend, one from Soho Square. I've got friends who are Muslims. I'm not going to be judged as a Muslim. I've got friends who are... They are not Muslim. They are. If they are... Take your friend, they are not Muslim, they are out of Islam. Ah, okay. ah. Lucky them, lucky them, more for salvation. So, if a Muslim take you... Take not the unbeliever for friends or allies. Yeah. Unless, ah, unless you're in a position of weakness and it will protect you. Ah, yeah? Is that true? Is that true? Yes. Is that true? What God? Unless, unless what? Unless you are a minority. Suko. Is that true? What you say Suko. that God? Suko. 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 He won't. So so. He won't argue. Is it? Why the nuns wear a hijab? Why she doesn't wear like Because nuns? I'm not a nun. <laughs> so are you nun bread or what? Uh, what a racist. <laughs> She's not a nun. What I'm you, not are you? a nun. I am a lay person. Let like I'm not a clergy person. I'm not. So I'm not. Tomorrow, if it's 39 or I will 40, never wear a bikini just what? because I know that you have thought of me in a bikini and ah. now, alas, no bikinis okay. from me. Ah, have you done that? Have you he he just did. He just did. 
Our oh, prophet said, this me are born. Your friends are going to be judged oh, by your thinking said, about me in a bikini. He said, he said, woman, yeah. dressed, yeah. and undressed. Oh, can I tell you about this? When uh, was it Abu Bakr? Dress, was it Abu Bakr? Asiatun, Ariatun. They are dressed. He's a rhymer. You can see everything. Almost everything shows. I can see all of this. <laughs> I can see everything. Ah, ah, he, ah, he. He is the cover. You know what I think he is the cover. What a man should be covering? He should be covering some ground, going to work, coming home and looking after covering his what? wife. Covering what? Ground. No, going no. to work, no. coming home again. Covering. Going to work, coming home From again. From his body, what he should be covering? Shh. What he should be covering? Whatever he fancy. I don't know. I'm From not his, his mother. Navel? Navel. Yes. Do me a favour. To the leg, to the knees. Is it? A but woman? you can have your boobs out if you're a man. A name, a woman, a woman. From there? To the floor. Here, no, there. what about there? Huh? What about this one? If you like it. If you ah, have, if no, you like no compulsion, if you are young, ladies. If you are young, you can do it. If you can take the heat. Do so it. you're confident that there's no pressure for Muslims to cover completely. You think it's just their choice, like even their mother doesn't like a, you know, like put some pressure. So you look like something. Islam is living. I know, I know. If you are, if you want to stuck in. 50% up to you. Ah, so if you're saying the true Islam is this one and the like 50% is just higher, the scarves and higher, jeans. Higher degree. Yeah. Oh, no, 110. No, no, no. Jeans is not in Islam. Jeans. Yes, but for you it's alright. Huh? But you're, you're supposed to have your trousers up above your ankle. You're not, your navel is fine. We're good so on the navel. My trouser and then the to Muhammad's like trousers. The thing like that. No, and this. no, because my uh, Jesus didn't tell me how to do it. He said, he said. Your Jesus said... I'm glad you know he's my Jesus. Yes, and my Jesus as well. Ah, you forget, you forgot yourself. <laughs> my Jesus said, yeah. because Isa yeah. alayhi salam, all his, all what he got is from the Almighty. And the Almighty never said word like this. But the Almighty, via Jesus, never didn't tell me modestly is fine. Covered, I am covered. Come on. Like, Listen, just because you've got x-ray vision, just because you can think about me in bikini, what is in your heart? If you look for it to a woman with lust, you've already committed adultery in your heart. If you hate in your heart, you're already a murderer. So take that and stick it in your shisha. If you know, if you know what I, what I... I know what you think, because you're always talking to me about sexualized something. This is, this is... You know why? <laughs> With a twinkle in his eye. Because this is the disaster of the West. But you're this the only the one who's bothered. No this one is else the, is running around telling me this. This is the disaster of... You want me in a sackcloth and ashes? This is the disaster of the Christian society. Oh, you're not the disaster of a Christian society. People running around telling people you're a whore, you're dressed like a something. It's not people like you. How many priests have your children? How many priests? What? How many vicars have children? No, thank you. How many what? I don't understand the question. How many, how many Christian, how many priests abused children? Okay, know, I, I, I'm going to answer. No, I'm going to answer. So far, yeah. I think it's, no, no, it's all right. I think it's probably, maybe they're following the example of Muhammad with Aisha at six years old and consummating at eight. So why would you ah, condemn yeah, a man yeah, yeah. who sleeps with a little girl when that is the sunnah? Why would you do that? Hypocrite. Now, now you're telling me. Did you just call me a you, Real life. you compare. Don't make me fight, yeah. You compare. Yes, I am. Yes. Yeah. A marriage. To it's a not. You can't marry a child in this country legally. You cannot do it. Who is this country? Oh, this country is who you're worried about 90, because 90, all the Christians. Ninety percent of the children are bastards. So what? <laughs> so we. Yeah, but technically, I can say the same to you. Whether your mum and dad are married or not. Look at him smiling and look, look, look. Honestly, what's that got to do with it? What is that red herring? Have you ever seen your dad? Yes. Do you know who's your dad? Yes. Who, the priest or who? No, who? I'm not a Catholic. Uh, I don't have a priest. My dad is the guy, not only on my birth certificate, he's on my DNA test. He was married to my mother. Married? My dad. According to what? According to which marriage? According to the church. Church? Yeah. Which church? church? The church. The church. Okay. How many bus are a child in Britain? My dad hasn't got any. Huh? What are you talking about? The Prime about? Minister have a, your so? role model have a bastard child. So where'd you get your 90% from, Omar? Everything. You're making it up. You pulled it out of your hat, no, which might no, have no. slipped. <laughs> Every woman in this country go to the bingo and find boyfriend. And what are you going? What yes. videos are you watching, yes. bruv? Yes. Sort your YouTube 
history yet. This year's Denmark, everybody shagging everybody. In Omar's imagination, it's a full on hardcore porn everywhere. Everybody shagging everybody. Is anyone shagging anyone? <laughs> no. No. Oh, yep, yeah, you said. No, I'm only joking. I'm joking. <laughs> Huh? But if you're the only one, listen, you with your Islam is the only one who seems to be obsessed with sex. I'm not. I was talking about something utterly different. So, my question again, this last sermon, how did he raise up women? I'm not a feminist. I know that in Jesus there's neither male nor female, there's no higher, only your husband. You're telling me. You are. I'm not telling you, I'm asking you, that's where we're going wrong. You ask me a fair question. Yes? Which? Which state? The man said, Azza! Which status is better? A woman is You're man. asking me a question. A what party do you uh, represent in the elections? Are you a politician? I'm asking you the same I question. So answer me. What did Mohammed do? Apart from saying you all come from Adam and he definitely pointed at the woman, whatever. It, apart from that, did he ever say, uh, why don't you treat your mums quite nicely? Why don't you. Uh, yes, he I'm said. So, so tell yes, me. The Prophet said, paradise. Under the feet of your mother. But he also said that, uh, also that Jannah is full of poor people and or majority poor and hell is majority women. Ah, so not so those mothers. Fight, yeah. They're under your feet while you're in heaven because you've got long legs and it's I reaching all the way down. Now we're talking about fight. Jesus and you're showing everything. What Jesus? Why, 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 why are you looking? Like I've got shorts on under my skirt. Look. They want to be okay. Shorts. No, 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 that's not a good oh. idea. They don't that's want to look. He's about to explode because he's seen a knee. <laughs> he's been giving him out for long enough, son. Which, which, which status is better? A Muslim to be woman in hell as a woman. a woman? No. Tell me why the majority of hell is women if, if Muhammad was lifting up a female kind in his last sermon. Why are they all in hell still? Why didn't he go and tell them? The majority of hell. That's what I already told him that. But I've been asking this question for like... What Allah said apart from this in Quran about women and about I'll the I'll tell people. you what he said about, well, not apart from that. Muhammad said that he had never, he, uh, that, the, that women were deficient in mind and religion. He told the old ladies when they asked him. Muhammad. Deficient, deficient in the brain. Like this, deficient hearing, deficient, no, it matters to him. Anyway, deficient in brain and mind and religion. So he's already telling everyone these women are a bit dopey and they're not good Muslims. What does it matter what he said? What does it matter what all these people said? Most of them are lying. We're going through priests. So why does it matter what he said? Because he's the greatest, ex greatest example for mankind. You have no respect. No, no, I was wondering, why would you respect a man who's a pedophile? We tried, we took a... No, 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 no. No, no. I've got your eyes on watching 1400, 40 years after Muhammad, peace be upon him. There is a woman in Africa now, married in this age. And they shouldn't be. They're wrong, they're all nonsense. They're fucking wrong. Stop shagging children. You're saying everyone's shagging them. But they're being manipulated. They're all shagging children. You're shagging children, brother. Last week. You want to look at Shiaism? Last week. He still tries. Go and find, go and bring your daughter down. Hey. Last week. Last week. Mammy said, Mammy's a pedophile. Ten years old. Ten years old. Here is pregnant. No. Just like Aisha would have been, you mean? Oh, how terrible. Someone's Following the example of so Muhammad, why, everyone. Why Get him. What do you mean why you condemn it? Because I condemn Muhammad as well. That's you why. Did you condemn that? You I condemn Muhammad. any man. Did you who condemn that? To... Yes, did I would. If I knew about pedophile? it, yes. You don't know why about you it, you you're hypocrite. I spend all of my time looking at Christian persecution of did Muslims did chopping up my brothers and sisters. No, I don't. You should stop reading about children. Yeah, you should. Did you read the verse? I don't read the verse. Yes. Hang on, wait. Excuse me. Wait. Sorry, sorry, sorry. Wait. It's better that you have a millstone tied around. Not you. This is what the, the Bible says. It's better that, that rather than hurt one of these little ones than to have a, a big stone around your neck and sink. So that's what Jesus did said. He didn't say, and you, you can marry him. You don't know what I read, Nanya. You don't read the Bible. Yes, I read it all the time. You never read that. Yes. From the Bible. The Bible is bad too. The Bible. Shush. Don't say that. Was longer than donkey. Yeah, I read that bit. Yeah. And his emission. I bet you stuck on that bit, though, didn't you, Omar? I, don't I bet you got. I bet you the page marked the bent over part. Yeah, you yeah. Like Fingerprint. No. You like it? No. Longer than donkey. But you know what it's talking about, though. And the emission, or you just like the like a. Uh, and the emission softball. longer than the flood. You wanna be flooded with the with the semen? I've more. read it. Is your question now? Have you read that you should chop them from arm from arm and crucify them, and they are the worst of all creatures? 
and you shouldn't take who's them for that? friends. Who's That's that? other human beings, who's that? Who's that? mate. Who's Let's that? not worry about donkeys at the who's minute. That? Who's that? That's the Quran, 929, 828. Uh, what you should do to apostates. Top, top what you should, top, top. The, the unbeliever, the apostate. No, no, this is the Muslim, you stupid. Yeah, I know, you stupid. This I'm talk, you're talking about the Bible and this I'm talking the about the Quran. The Muslims, so what, I don't care about Muslims? You donut. You you don't stupid me. How come? What? How come? Because Jesus commanded me to. You cannot care Even about you. you cannot Even about you. Yourself. Yes, I can. How do you know my heart? Are you Yahweh? No. You telling me. I you am telling you, whatever it is you now, yeah. You someone get crucified and beaten and stoned. If an apostate is killed I'm by any member of your religion, from your religion, it's my, my business. Religion just causes war yeah. for all of us. Because everyone is created by my God. My God created that soul that someone from your religious text has had. Bro, bro. Anyway, it's my business because they are human beings. And I don't think of anyone as my enemy, but I'd love them even if I did. I can't, I don't know. Who knows? Let me just move my mind. He's not defending me. He doesn't believe the Bible. He doesn't believe the Bible. I've seen it, I've seen it. All right, let's not. Do you want to talk reasonable? I'm trying. i am move my mic. Tell me. Honest opinion. Which? Who is in better status? Status, as in, in what respect? Spiritual or, or secular? A woman in Islam yep. or a woman in Christianity? Christianity all day long. Yeah. Really? Yes, 100%. Now I'm going to tell you so, why. I'm so glad you asked. Why? 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 One, they have uh, salvation. Two, they have freedom. Three, they are not uh, called deficient in mind and religion. Four, they're not making up the majority of hell. Five, they don't have to get married off when they're six or slash eight. Six, they don't get sold into slavery in this time right now. Seven, oh, Joel, is seven. Talak, talak, talak. There is none of that. They don't have to go and sleep with an imam to get back to the same husband. None of that shizzle. So that's all of that bit. Then they've got the love of the uh, community. They've got the love of the church. They ain't got the love of you, but you've got the spirit of the Antichrist. So what can I say? But you do love me, but just in a sort of sexual way. So the point is that I've listed 10. Now you tell me our Muslims are better off than Christian women. And you're going to say, because they dress in a bed sheet. Go. Our Muslim sister and yep. mother, yep. they are not feeling Marbella now and this with bikini and here. Was that yep. my reason that Christians are better off though? Anything to do with sex or bikinis? You're what, just the what one. What your religion done to you? What's it done to me? It's give me salvation. Yes, it's put me in touch with the Holy the Spirit. Yes, you are the protection of the Bible. No. No, I was lost and I was sinning you and I already knew lost. the Bible. You are more I'm lost. sinless. You are still lost more than you are being away of Jesus. Are you this mental? Woman. I'm sinless. You are still lost, lost. Lost, yes, 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 yes. yes. Even, even now I'm sinning. I'm looking at you and I'm thinking, Number ooh. Number two, you said a Muslim woman have to marry Imam. Whoever told you that, he's a bastard. He didn't say marry, he said nikah. He didn't say marry. Who told nikah? Uh, Muslim. Muslim who? If you, you divorce your you wife and she wants to come back to you, does she have to sleep with another man? Yeah. Yes or no? Sleep with another man? Oh, please stop. Is there an echo in here? Sleep? Yeah. Sex, I mean, darling. I don't mean a little to 40 marriage weeks. And marriage in Islam. Divorced? No, no, no. And then I say to no, you, come no, back, no. love. This to you. you can just come back, yeah? No, no, no. Oh, I'm mistaken. Marriage in Islam. Marriage in Islam, you silly. Okay. Is. Donut. Is. Abadi. It's multiple. No, it's not. Talak. 65-4. Surah 65-4. What is 65-4? Ah, don't talk silly. Don't pretend to be ignorant. 65-4. Talak. <laughs> okay, this guy doesn't know his own religion. That's all. Okay, we have divorce is forbidden for us unless there is uh, adultery. You know what is? Oh, there's a uh, unyoking. What is the result of divorce forbidden you? All this. You'll be forgiven, obviously. The majority are prostitutes. You'll be what? Yes. So ninety percent of something or other. Everyone's shagging everyone, including this gentleman right here. <laughs> now ninety percent of women are prostitutes. I'll be in a bikini tomorrow because it's hot. He's got his navel covered though, so we're all great. You're telling me. I am. You're telling yeah. me. Yes. <laughs> Are you telling a me, bro? A woman cannot do divorce. She's going to go to the idea now, Jesus, Jesus. She no. will. No. All right, chill out with your hands, love. She, can divorce. she can divorce. the internet. She can divorce in the event of adultery or if her husband becomes a Muslim, for example. If they're no longer both believers or there's some adultery, How they can be divorced. How many women they it's a prostitute, not 90%. Her, how, more, how, many, how many women in Britain? How many prostitutes do tell, you know? Tell her husband. How many have you paid? Friday. See you Monday, my love. See you Monday, I'm going to my boyfriend. Yeah. How many? How many? Hang on a minute. Let me use my psychic powers. One second. Ooh, at least a couple. No way, you just make up stats. 
Do you know, 73% of statistics are made up on the spot. 73.7. Hang on, 82.6 are made up on the spot. Hey, I'm going to pay your ticket. Oh yeah, you got money? No, no, no. Yes, I got money. Whoa, you make a good husband for someone, just not me, because you don't but believe. But I wish they don't. Last, every time I come with money here, they confiscate it. I well, you're dough. Yeah? You, you're selling drugs again. I don't sell drugs. <laughs> you're running prostitutes. Why is I, your money illegal? Why are they taking your money? Illegal, because they bastard. Oh, their mums and dads are not married. Maybe they're no, no, prostitutes. No, they bastard. Oh, bastards as in like a... And the same, because Muslim money, they have to take the anima. It's not Muslim money, it's English money in your pocket. But it's mine. But is that stick because you're supposedly like a... You know, so hindered. With police with them. Did you hit somebody with your with uh, your one. disabled no, assistant? Not this one. Not this one. DNA test. The other one. <laughs> Black, Black Life Matter want to buy it. <laughs> wow! Get it on eBay, people. And they said. What did he say? This is this is the only way to deal with the bastard. Wow! Yes. It must be true then. Yes. If BLM said it. It must be true. They got to say. Wow. You, Do you like BLM? Do you like the, that organization, the uh, going on the knee and all that? It's a bit much if you've got a stick, me, you can't take the to knee. Me, if I go Black Lives Matter, I'll be racist. It's true. I it's true, they are racist. Every life matters. Yeah, but Black Lives Matter are literally life racist. Matter. Yeah. Even Jews, Jews lives. Does your Quran agree with that though? No! The rocks are going to be shouting at. There's one. Get him. Ah, yeah. <laughs> all of them pushed into the sea. Hezbollah, <laughs> Hamas. <laughs> He knows he's true. Now that's Jesus just caused him to stumble there. No, he knows, he knows he's true. He knows he's true. The Jews, the Jews who killed your Jesus? No. No, they're dead. Yeah. Adult Jews. Jesus gave Jews who were born last week. Sorry? Jews who are like 10 days old, maybe. Jews who have uh, never even heard of Jesus. KKK after BLM. Not the case. Yeah, that's what you'd love to think, isn't it? I'm going to be nice to you. Aw, thank you. Is it. Nice. Thank you very much. So, so well. Thank you. One call. So, so. Are they poisoned or not? Yeah. Okay, give me free. I like the number. The three. Bible says you can I eat like it the anyway. Number three. Trinity. Thank you. One call. So, so well. If I, by the way, everyone, if, if if it's some Snow White moment and I just go into a sleep for a hundred years, it's because of him. You can't have my cherry. Come to that. I am in the truth. Jesus Christ said, I am the way, the truth, and the life. No one goes to the Father except by Him. Jesus made this be upon them, said. He don't need your peace. He said. He don't need peace. He is the truth. He is love. He is the Almighty. The one who comes after me. Yeah. The Holy Spirit. The one who will always be with you. Where's Muhammad? Where's Mohammed? He ain't with me, he ain't indwelling me. I definitely wouldn't know about it. I know you are jealous of Muslim men and Muslim women. You would love it if I was jealous because that would denote that I have something lacking. Muslim but what I have, God's grace is sufficient for me. You don't know what you're missing. God's grace is sufficient. I'm not missing anything. You don't know what you're the missing. creator of the heavens and the earth loved me enough to die for me. I'm not missing anything. Well, I'm not. What yeah, stupid is the Bible? The yeah, Jesus Christ created it, all things, and then He died for me, as if I was the only person. Exactly. This is very you should come to Jesus, Omar. You're calling Jesus stupid. You're calling Jesus stupid, and you're a Muslim. Your your perception about Jesus. No, the Bible, the Allah revealed. The Bible's corrupted. Well, show me where. Show me evidence. 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 How many people? And borrow me your chair. No, How many people wrote the Bible? Uh, I don't know, forty something. Yeah. How you many know. people wrote down the Quran after it was burned by um, Us Quran, Uthman? Look, you, you just keep smiling. You, you, you it's enough the Quran owner is memorized. But it's memorized by people who didn't have the, the Kira and the Aruf. So how can they, uh, what are they? They're reciting the words and then they're running to someone, maybe he's got a different accent. Maybe he's writing it down, you see? Because there are different, like there's You're verses. Jealous. I'm so yeah. jealous, How many dude. Bibles there is? How many I'm Bibles? well jealous. How many Bibles there is? Loads of translations, but there's only one Bible. Which one? The Bible. One? That's what we call it, the Bible. Which Bible? The Bible. The Bible. The, Bible. the. The Old Testament? No, 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 the complete. The Genesis to Revelation Bible. So they are one Bible, yeah? Yes, and they're different translations. Always once, from the Greek to Nothing. the English. From the Greek once to the no English. Shot been taken away uh, no, well, the Catholics, um, they no code. They, no, away. the Catholics accepted officially no, some theology, books. And, it, and none of those books that are added or taken away. Be, so, so no, no, he's a married. No, no, no. 
Are so you the, uh, yeah, he's got children. The Are point you is, Are you no, I'm not. Oh, so the oh, point oh, is, oh. Shay. The point is the Bible. The Bible. None of those books that are taken or put in say, oh, Jesus ain't God though. Like they're all the same do you, theology. Do you want to be right hand or no? Get behind me, Satan. <laughs> he just asked me if I want to be a. What did, you, what, did he, what did he say? What did he say? He's got his right hand in his pocket. I can't take it. This is just checking. No, thank you very much. It's a very kind offer, but I'm going to have to uh, stick with Jesus for the moment. For always, but you know. Look, look. I think it's wrap up time. Yeah, well, people. Look, the Holy Spirit. Maybe just spirit. <laughs> I don't know, I don't know. Right, wrap up. All right, you want to do a final, final words? Hey, hey, final words. Final words. One tablet will cure all your disease. Once a morning. <laughs> One tablet. For the coronavirus. One tablet. Islam will heal all your disease. We've got one tablet with 10 commands on it, two tablets. Disease, AIDS, uh, usury, alcoholic, gambling. But Jesus made wine. Isa made wine. Kosher wine, you silly. He didn't make wine. He did. No profit, no profit drunk. Uh, excuse me, Mah no, they did. no, no, you're fibbing now because Muhammad is the one who brought in that it's haram. And you know it because Allah said it used to be a blessing. Jews, Don't fib. Uh, Don't fib. Jews said it's haram. You liar. I'm telling you that when Muhammad Jews made it's haram. I don't care about Jews. I'm Why? Using, this is not the, listen the, the Torah. To what, listen, to, the Torah. listen to listen to what I'm telling you. What listen, what you please li listen. Allah, when he forbade alcohol, said it used to be this way, and now it's going to be this way. And that means that the prophets of old, when the Bible hey, says, "Don't look jerk. at the woman, look at the Muslim Why do, woman. You're the one who looks at women all the time. <laughs> look at the devil I'm between you and here. Yeah, exactly. So keep looking that way, bro. Which one, Mullis? Keep looking that way. I don't look this way or this you, way. Hey, I'm trying, Takia. I'm trying to tease you. Are you? This woman, <laughs> younger than my little son. Is it? Well done, you. So, but that doesn't mean she's uh, forbidden. Yeah. Doesn't mean she'll but be her I up. Enough, she, she's over eight. I had enough. Excellent. I well done. Yeah, you look like it, sir. I had enough. Right, wrap up. Right. What can you do? Do you envy her? Do you envy her? No, I don't envy anyone. You should envy her. She has no salvation. You had envy her. Excellent. Can I do my wrap up now, love? You should envy her because she's got a very nice, a more Masha flowing Allah. thingy than you. Masha Allah. Is it? Yeah, Mash and bangers. Okay. Anyway, so my wrap up is, oh, I don't know what's going on. Let's yeah. carry on. I said, today is what it means. God wills. God wills it. Like in Shalaya, that's what it means in Latin. Is that all right with you, fam? It's not that deep. Chill. Let me put my sunglasses. Yeah. You do that. Can you just let me do my wrap up, though? Do you mind? Thank you. <laughs> Get it, seriously. It's too freaky, man. Stop it. Put your stick away. Go and go and skip or skip. Thank go. you very much. You're welcome. Oh, you can't even elbow. Right, I'm wrapping up. Uh, this is wrapped up, everyone. For Jesus, Jesus alone uh, is able to grant salvation to those who believe in Him and the sacrifice that He made uh, for all. That any anyone who believes in Him will not perish but have eternal life. Muhammad cannot offer salvation. Muhammad cannot even offer a guarantee that his own sins were forgiven. He said he repented 70 times a day, but to be fair, he was a busy boy, so he probably had a lot to be uh, sorry for and turn away from. So yeah, I'm glad that Omar is still like, still coherent. And uh, we're gonna pray for him. Everyone pray for Omar, please. And uh, pray for all the Muslims at the park, that they come to the truth, and the truth will set them free and free indeed. Amen. Laters. Right. Cut.